Happy holidays. And happy holidays to you too, Jill. We have a question from Lloyd Dobler who writes, My girlfriend is really into cycling, but the only sport I'm into is kickboxing. I need to get her a gift. What do you suggest? Thoughts? So some recommendations, bar tape. You can kind of sneakily see what brand that your friend likes. Just look at their bike. That's always a good one to have on hand. And what brand do you suggest for Lloyd? Uh, a lot of people, well, actually, I don't want to say super cabs because like so many people are against that. Okay, fair enough, Jill. What do you use? I personally don't have a preference. Like I think I do use super cabs. <laughs> like, I don't care. I just don't like thick bar tape. Anything else? Nowadays, because equipment is getting really hard to come by, even something as mundane as a chain <laughs> might be greatly appreciated because they're, they're getting pricey and, and hard to find. Uh, I would say basic tools like a chain checker is a great one. If your friend doesn't have their own basic toolkit, you can help them start building it up with like a cassette tool is a great one with a chain whip so they can change and fix their own cassettes or they can swap it between wheel sets. Oh, I think a torque wrench set could be a great gift. or a gift certificate to a bike shop. <laughs> That's always a welcome one. If you're looking for a gift under $50 or around $50, you might be able to afford one bottle cage, upper end. <laughs> and that could be like a nice carbon one or a titanium one. Titanium is a great option. Be careful though, because some people are very picky about the look they're going for, so they might not want titanium on their bike. But I would always love a titanium bottle cage. <laughs> so Jill, what's the best gift you've ever received? The best cycling gift I've ever received was a set of wool arm covers and wool leg covers and wool socks. I love everything wool. They changed my life. I use them all the time. And so I would actually, I got that as a gift. I would repeat gift that to other people for sure. The arm covers and leg covers that I got were defeat. And I really like that company. I think they make good stuff. And turning the question back around on you, Jill, what's the best gift that you've ever given? Okay, what is the best gift I've given a cyclist? It's a very tiny gift. One was a valve core tool because I think that's a very important thing to have in your saddlebag. It's super small, but you never know, especially with tubeless now, when you're gonna need that tool to remove like the valve core or the, the whole valve and you might not be able to unscrew it with your fingers. Another great gift that I've given someone is a valve extender. Because again, that's a really simple thing you can put in your saddlebag, takes no room, doesn't add any weight and it could save you because if you have wheels or your friend has wheels that are deeper than the tube you have and this happens all the time on group rides everyone we all have tubes but the valve is not long enough to fit through that wheel so if someone is carrying that extender then any tube will work and you might save your own ride but you also might save your friend's ride well, that's it for today. If you enjoyed the episode, please hit the like button. And if you haven't subscribed already, please consider doing so. Also, if you have a question for Jill that you'd like answered in a future episode, go ahead and leave a comment below and we'll see what we could do. Okay, yeah, we'll see you on the road.